Welcome to the ESI Africa studio, broadcasting from Enlit, Africa. Today I'm speaking with Ramaja Dungan, who is the Managing Director of Ado Force. Welcome to the studio. Thank you so much. So we've got a lot to talk about, but let's start about uh, looking at grid stability. What is the important factors that we need to know? We need to know on grid stability, um, how to, to stabilize our grid is, is to, to, to have storage by storing energy, storing power, mm. uh, storing power from our grid. Now, by so doing, we can generate. Generation comes from wind turbine, it comes from solar panels, it comes from hydro, it comes from fuel as well, diesel uh, and, and fuel. So if we create power, we also have the advantage likewise to generate fuel. That, that is the most important part. If we, we, we can have that stability, we we'll always have an uh, advantage to, 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 have, to create uh, fuel. Now, with our solar, with our, uh, our, our wind, with our hydro and fuel, we, we, might, we will stabilize through storage. Now, how are we going to store? We're doing storage into our batteries, into our reservoirs. Mm -hmm. Now, if we store power into the reservoirs, into the batteries, we will be able, at least, able to stabilize, which means we'll be able to keep the same vo voltage mm -hmm. and the frequency the whole time on our network. And that then creates, as you say, the stable network. Yes. But with the change that is happening in the market, with the advances in renewable energy, there is also a change in our workforce. So what are the skills that are needed? Engineering skills. That's, 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 that's number one for me. I'll say we need engineers. We need contractors. Uh, we need designers as well. Enge electrical engineers, electrical designers, and we need electrical contractors to, mm. to, 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 to start this. Because of now, it's, it's, it's a totally new thing that's coming on. Now we need to go, we need to learn. I think the knowledge is, is something that we, we must also focus on. We need to learn to know how are we going to go about this renewable energy. Because everybody knows electricity, we know electricity, but now because of the change you are talking about, we need to go and study again. Most of us now, as myself, I've done courses for installation, PV mounting. I've done uh, uh, courses again here in Cape Town. For, 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 for roof mounting, all types of roofs, which we are still, uh, our company now moving slowly into, into renewable uh, uh, installation and so yes. forth. Yeah. Yes. So we're talking about um, grid stability, the expertise that is needed, but let's talk about the critical aspect of maintenance. What is your advice to professionals? I think we, that my advice would be let's 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 go back to the dream board by collecting the database let's have database of our network let us collect the database let us re let us register let us know our our network uh, uh, we, we in south africa we've got nine provinces i'm from free state i work in the northern cape as well but now to study the knowledge of our network and then if we have that critical knowledge uh, of, of, of our network, together with the new Minister of, 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 of Energy, uh, our, our Dr. Kutien Tsuramukhopa. As he said, he's here to learn as well. So through him and through us, uh, the engineers and the contractors uh, uh, collaborating, we, 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 can, we, can, we, can, we can try to win this, this fight. But the most important thing, it goes back to maintenance. Mm. Uh, 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 if we have the, 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 the database, we have the data sheet, we, know, we have the know-how of, of, of what is happening around our, our network, then we know exactly where the problem is. Maintenance, we need to do maintenance. What, what I mean about maintenance, we need to do replacement of, 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 of equipment, infrastructure. From, oh, from, from way back, you know, these things are, are older than me, I know they are older than you. The infrastructure that we are talking about, uh, the lifespan mm. of transformers, the, the, the lifespan of turbines, the lifespan of, of, of lines, uh, MV lines and transmission lines. 
are 62, 70 years. Now, imagine I've been born, I'm a electrical contractor today. For 15 years, I'm owning this company. But still, there are some things that are still standing. So we need to go back and look into our database to see what has been done or what should be done for us in order to stabilize the grid. Without maintenance, I always argue with people, we have technology. Technology can tell us exactly where to go, where to maintain, and what is wrong. And, and, and contracts are, contractors are there, engineers are there. We work hand in hand, in hand on this field. And then we can stabilize our grid. That is not the current match. That is not the current match at all. Uh, thank you so much for sharing that with us, Ramaja, and it, for being with us in the studio. Thank you so much for having me as well. To all our viewers, thank you for watching. Stay tuned for the next video.